Thrasher and Hollywood making movies right now because of us. Because they believe in us and what we're doing. I'm on the phone with every studio at night. Insurance companies. Producers. And they're looking at us and using us to make their movies. We are creating thousands of jobs. I don't ever want to see it again. Ever. And if you don't do it, you're fired. And I see you do it again, you're gone. And anyone on this crew does it. That's it. And you do. And you do. And you. Don't you ever do it again. No apologies. You can tell it to the people that are losing their fucking homes because our industry is shut down. It's not going to put food on their table or pay for their college education. That's what I sleep with every night. So I'm sorry, I'm beyond your apologies. I have told you, and now I want it. And if you don't do it, you're out. We are not shutting this movie down. All righty then. Hey, man. As you can see, I'm smiling because that actually gave me goosebumps. Let, let me uh, let me set it up. This is Tom Cruise uh, recalibrating his crew for breaking COVID-19 protocols. I don't have an issue with it at all, with what he said or how he said it. Now, I understand some people are going to disagree with that. Trust me and believe this video is not for you. I'm speaking to who I'm speaking to. I'm speaking to people who's ever been a supervisor. I'm speaking to people who have ever been a, a safety or compliance officer. I'm speaking to people who's ever worked on an oil rig, been a fireman, worked on a barge crew, been in the military, any branch. I'm speaking to you. I'm speaking to people who've been a range boss. People who at some point have had their asses chewed or chewed somebody's ass about breaking safety protocols. Now, I'm big on safety protocols. When safety protocols are broken, people die, people get hurt, and the enthusiasm for whatever the mission is fades. They, we're in this touchy-feeling society. They feel like, you shouldn't talk to people like that. You can't. Yes, mean talk. It hurts their feelings. You should be able to communicate better. That's rude and appropriate. Damn that. People sometimes only respond to you when you put your clown suit on and act a clown. Especially if you had to tell them several times. That brought me joy. I feel like that should happen more. Sometimes people got to get a talking to. If you're in a position of authority and you're responsible for the bigger picture, you can't have people doing whatever the hell they want to do. And putting your clown suit on is warranted every now and then. I was at the range recently and there was a bunch of youngsters in there shooting at the range, completely ignoring every safety protocol of the range. They don't have no, they don't have no gun discipline. They don't have no trigger discipline. They're all across the line with hot weapons. They're laughing and joking. The range boss came in there and shut the whole range down and proceeded to, to verbally recalibrate them individuals and broke them down to parade rest right there in front of everybody. And it brought a smile to my face. And I can remember the youngsters looking around at the other adults like, ain't nobody gonna say nothing to him by talking to us like that? No, we're not. No, he's, he's right. And they proceeded to pack their stuff up and leave. And which they should, you know, if you out there and you're not taking it seriously, I don't want you around me with a weapon anyway. I just want to thank Tom Cruise right now. That there cheered me up. That that that, that there lifted my spirit. Because the moral of the story is, no matter how you flip it, fat meat remains greasy.